This is the unboxing for some beautiful shelves I just received. I'm so excited about them. An unboxing is when you see exactly what I see when I take it out of the box. And in it, it has an installation guide. And look, look at this beautiful wood. It's so perfect. Look at this. It's very, very lightweight. And it is very beautiful. Really, really beautiful. Look at this. There's four of the shelves. One. Oh my gosh. That's even prettier. Look at that. Oh gosh, this is just stunning. Beautiful, beautiful. The quality is really nice. It's got a beautiful finish on it. Very well made. Really have a kid. There's two. <laughs> the first one was so different from the second one. I'm excited to see what three and four looks like. Comes very well packaged. Look, it's all packaged to protect it. There's the third one. Look. Oh, that's beautiful. Gosh, that is stunning. What a lovely, lovely piece of wood. That's gorgeous. And then here's the fourth one. Ready? Let's see what the pattern is on this. Look, look. Oh, gosh, that's so pretty. Wow. That is truly beautiful. I am really impressed on how well everything is finished off. It's gorgeous. Okay, those are the four shelves. And as you look at, at the guide that comes with it, it tells you exactly what's in the box. So we just got out the four pieces of absolutely drop-dead gorgeous wood. Okay, and I'm going to slide those sideways. And it still says that we have the iron pieces left. This is a plastic piece that goes in the wall and the two different sizes of screws. Now, obviously, there's a reason for the two different sizes of screws. And let me get them out first. Okay. There we go. Nicely packaged in a plastic bag to keep them handy. I'm just going to put them out like this so you can see them. We're supposed to have 16 long screws. Okay, oops, I just bumped that. Get that up a little bit here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, come back here, buddy. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and looks like I've got an extra one in there. All right, so we've got the 16 pieces that said here. We're just going to do that again. There's 5, 10, 15, 16, and we have an extra long one. Okay. Now, let's read how many of these are we supposed to get. And this is a step, by the way, do not mistake doing this step because you need to make sure you have everything in the box. Okay, so there's those. And now the smaller ones are supposed to have, of course, 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Got it. 11, 12. I've got another big one. 13, 14, 15, 16. So actually, I'm lucky. I got an extra one of the small one, and I got two extra ones of the long ones. Yay. Okay. And now, the plastic pieces, 16 are those, because the long pieces go in here. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and two extras. So I really, really like this company. They've added a few extras so that we've made sure that we've got all of them. Okay, now, what's the next thing on here? Oh, okay, now we need the angled pieces of iron. And this is the support for the shell. Oh, look, you know they've done a really nice job about cutting the holes out. Now, how many of those do we need? Double check it. We need eight. One, two, and if you look in here, hold on, I'm gonna just grab it this way. They're very nicely packaged individually in, there's two in each one here. Well, here we go. They're in, actually individually, okay? So that they come in really good condition. And how many again? Double checking, eight. Okay, so here we go. 
There's four there, and here's four more. All right. So what we have in the box is our wood, our metal pieces, and the screws. Okay. And that's everything that was in the box. Now I'm going to put the box over here and I'm going to move these like this. Put wood pieces in behind. So that is everything you need. And this is a pretty easy setup. Now there's really good instructions on here on how to how to install it. I'm going to tell you a way that I do it. Um, they're using a power drill. I don't. I never have had a power drill. My husband has one, but I like to do mine differently. So the long piece, that's going to go on your wall. Okay. The short piece, this goes on underneath on the bottom part like this. All right. And what I'm going to do, let me move this so you can see exactly what I'm going to do is this is your installation part of it. We did the unboxing. This is the installation part. I'm going to do it backwards like this so you can see, okay? I'm going to place these where I want them to go. Now, what I strongly recommend you do is measure this, okay? You want to make sure that your width is the same. You can use a ruler. I'm one of those people that I use pieces of paper. I'm not really great on math. So I would take this, it was in the box. And so I'm going to take this and make sure I have the same distance from the edge so right there, I already know, I'm gonna put it right there. And I'm gonna take this on the other side. I'm gonna put it right here and I'm gonna butt that right up to the edge. And I'm gonna have it the same distance. That's how I do it. Now, if you want to do it with a ruler, you know, that's okay, you can do it with a ruler too, but this is just really, really simple for me. Now, what I like to do is I get a pencil. And with my pencil, I'm going to draw a little circle in here you see what I'm doing? I'm making a little mark. Make another mark here, because I know that's where I want it to go. Coming down on the other end, I'm going to take a pencil. I'm make a little mark. Make another little mark. Okay. I hope you can see it on the video when I lift this up. Yep, you can. Ta-da! Easy peasy. I'm going to hold the board up so that you can see it. Can you see where my marks are? Right there. So what I want to do for me... And um, I'm going to just demonstrate it. Hold on one second. I would use a nail. I'm just going to, I'm demonstrating. So I'm just showing you what I do. With the nail, I'm going to hammer that in and wiggle it around so it gives me a start. And actually, I can even, this wood is really, really light and easy to make a mark. So I'm just going to make that, wiggle it around. It's better with a nail, but a pin does work. And then I'm going to be using this, put this back on so it matches up. Can you see I'm gonna get it right matched up? That's where I want it to be, right there. And then I'm gonna take this nail and just move it so you can feel, see I can feel where I made the mark, and start turning with your hand. Actually, I am very shocked that this wood is light enough that even just with my hands, look at, can you see that? It's already in there. So I just take a screwdriver. I'm going to finish screwing that down. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing on either side. And then all I have to do, I'm lining up these marks too. All I'm going to have to do after I get this screwed on here is I take these and I make a little hole in the wall and, my, and it just pushes in. And then when you take this screw, watch carefully because I'm showing you how to do this. You're going to put, this is going to be in the wall here, and you're going to be putting it through like this. And when you turn it, these open. Okay, this is going to open, and that's going to be in the wall. And that's basically how you install it. It's very easy to do. I was planning on actually installing it on my wall, but we're having a bathroom remodeled, and this is for my bathroom shelves. And the people that are remodeling it, we had some floods and storms here, and... Um, there was trees across the road and they couldn't get in. So I don't have a wall to put it on yet. So your installation video for me, let me take this off the stand. Your installation video is me showing you how. See how simple that is? And you saw, I just used a pin, right? Look at this. 
that's pretty sturdy and all I have to do is just take a screwdriver and screw that down and the same thing with the screw to the wall and just do that four times put put the shelves the way I want them and, and they'll look beautiful again we're gonna cover what was in the box four absolutely beautiful pieces of wood and I read that these are handmade uh, and hand done there this is absolutely gorgeous it comes with your meta supports it comes with your beautiful wood pieces it comes with everything you need and extras and this is a lot easier for me to do than um, use a power drill or anything I just I'm just gonna tighten that down with the screwdriver and put this this one goes in the boards these two go on the wall and you're good to go I really really love this these shell set um, and I know you will too. 